Hey guys, today I'll be doing some walkthrough solves um, of the 4x4 using the Yao method. So, I'm just going to quickly scramble the queue and then get back to you once I've done so. So, the cube's all scrambled and I'm just going to go through what I would do if I got this in solved. So, I'm not color neutral on 4x4, so um, I probably would ignore this, but I do see a yellow bar and some white pieces. Um, I can tell that if I just slice this over here, that that will be a really easy center. Um, and then I would uh, make a bar here, bring this up here, and... Uh, make a make my other center Okay, so Now I'm just gonna do My edges, so I'll just ed pair this one up um, Insert this here to line these two up um, This one was already in which is convenient. So now that I have my three um my three edges, um, I can start with centers, but before I do that, I'll quickly just fix this one, because this one was next to the green, but it's supposed to be opposite green, and this is fine as well. So, um, I can see that this center is nearly done, so I'll just finish this one up, and then I'll probably do... Yeah, I'll, I'll just do the blue face right here. So I'll get a bar here, and then before I slice this back down, um, actually no, I, I will slice this back down, and then bring this one up, get the top one, bring it back down to pair this up, um, bring this across, and then bring this up twice, bring it back down. So now I have my orange and the blue one done so now um this is pretty easy bring this up and pair this up like that okay so for my last two i do see that they're both adjacent to each other i think that's the right word so i will actually just put this um across take this out and slice back again and then i can quickly insert this here and then bring the bottom one, so it's right here. So, for my edge pairing, um, I see, yeah, okay. I see that this yellow one is here, so I'll take this yellow out, and then I'll put it opposite of this yellow one, and then I can see that this will be, this has to go here, pretty easy. So one more, uh, this has to go here, which means the red and green will go here, which is right here. There's the yellow, red and green. Put that in. I'll do my slice, and then when I slice back, there's my red and blue, red and blue here. Um, this will go here. And for the last one, this will go here. Slice back. That's nicely done. And then my last one's right here. Um, just I'll just quickly do the algorithm. Like that. Whoops. Yep, like that. And then just three by three stage. Um, I won't do a walkthrough for three by for the three by three stage because that's pretty pointless. Um so yeah, I'll just get back to my next scramble. Okay, for the this scramble, um, when I'm inspecting, I can see that there's a bar here and a bar here as well. So that's pretty nice. Um, and then I'll go for whites first. There's a white here and a white there. So um, I'll align, I'll align these two up. Bring this, make this bar. And then bring this back up here. Um, and then this one's pretty straightforward. Okay, so for the next one, um, 
I'll probably just move this down and line this one up, pair it up, bring it back down. Okay, uh, what next? Okay, so, um, if these two are, um, not opposite of each other, a good trick is, uh, do, put this back to the back, and then rotate the bottom layer twice, the bottom, uh, wedge, I should say, and then it should be paired up. Put this down, and the last one is the same case, so, like that right here and down and these two, three are all in the correct spots okay firstly I see there's a red bar I'll put that to the side I also see there's green uh, I mean orange nearly done so yeah I think I'll quickly do the orange and then um, since this bar is already done um, I'll focus on these two, so these two are aligned, align them, bring this back down, and make this, so this has to be blue, which there's already a bar, okay, so I'll bring this blue up, get rid of this, bring this blue back down, which makes a bar here, um, yeah, and then I'll bring this blue across, and fix it like that, so for the last one, um, I'll slice this this top layer, put this in, so that when I slice back, it's already there. Okay, so now I'll go on with edge pairing. So the first thing I see is these two, so I'll quickly just realign this, and then this is red and blue, red and blue, same thing, quickly realign it. Um, and then there's orange and yellow right here. Slice. See red and yellow. One. Uh, two. And three. Got it. So for the last one. Um, do the, the parity algorithm. So it goes like. And done. So yeah, that's the. So now I'll go on to the third scramble. Okay, for the third scramble, um, first off I notice bar here, and the two white pieces are here. <laughs> um. So yeah, what I do for this is uh, make this turn turn this one, so then I can slice this up without moving the bar away like that and the next one I see bar here um, I'll move this bar to the top align these two and solve this bar like that okay so I'll probably do oh you know how um, in the last one I showed you this case well since it's since it's like this, instead of bringing it up and then doing the R2, I'd probably just bring it here and just do the R prime, and then do the D2, and then insert it, if you know what I mean, and then this one joined up as well, insert that, and the last one, same case again, but this time, um, instead of doing the D2, um, I'll do the, the U2, because this one's in the top instead of the bottom. Okay, so again, the orange one is... Actually, all of them are pretty good, so... But uh, since I saw the orange one first, in a real solve, I'd probably just go along with the orange. Um, move this so that um, these two meet up here, and then this is in the same spot. Like that. And then this has to be green. But I'd probably just do, actually, yeah, I'll, I'll do green, like that, and then right there, and then red. Okay, this ended up being solved, pretty convenient. 
Now I'll just go on with the edge pairing. There's a lot of yellows up there, so I was just quickly scanning to see if any of them were actually solved, which they weren't. Um, so I'll put this blue in, blue and yellow, blue and yellow, green in, so that's two, one more. Uh, this one and this one. So there's all three, slice, put this one in, green and orange, green and orange is here. Uh, this one, yep, right here, and, yeah, I think that's three, yep, that was three, and then this one, again, parody, so, slice this, parody algorithm, slice back, um, so, yeah, I believe that's my third soul, so, I'll scramble it again, and come back with the fourth scramble. Okay, for the fourth scramble, first thing I notice is, um, two whites right here, so, um, I'll solve that real quick, make a bar here, and then pair these up, like that, rotate to put white to the bottom, make a yellow here, put the yellow up, and then make another yellow bar, and solve it. Okay, so I'll put this in, make this blue, um, put the blue in, and then finally make this green. Okay, so now what I'll do is probably go for this orange make this bar and then rotate orange down go for the green like that go for red and then last um, last edge right here slice and dice, I mean slice back. <laughs> um, oh wait, yep, yeah, right here. Okay, so um, I noticed that this one's already solved, so I'll just move that to the top. Notice that this is this is orange and I mean not orange, red and yellow. So I'll find the red and yellow on the top, which I don't think it is. So it must be. Yeah, it's right here. So, put red and yellow here, green is on the top, green and yellow, blue and orange is right here, slice, okay, so this actually paired up four, which isn't the best thing in the, wor in the world, so what I probably would do is just replace this with, just replace this one with something that's not solved and then re replace this with something that's not solved and then replace this with something that's not solved okay and then slice back I mean I know that is messing up this pair but that's this case doesn't really ha happen that often so for the next thing you want to do is find two that are opposite each other so like this one and then also notice that which one that you're moving away. Actually, yeah, moving away. So that's the yellow and blue. So, and then you find the yellow and blue, which is right here. Take it out. Slice. And then you put the yellow and blue right here. And then you put it back in. So like that. So you just solve two. And then the last one is just normal parity. Like this. And there you go. For the last scramble, the first thing I notice is that there's a huge chunk of white right here. So I'm just gonna quickly solve this. Rotate to the rotate that to the bottom. And then um, make a yellow bar right here. 
move it up here, make the last yellow bar, and solve this. Okay, so now um, I see that there's orange here, orange here, so I can just do that trick. But this time instead of doing the D2, I think it'll be easier to just do the U2 Prime. Just rotate it down knowing that orange is right here, even though I can't see it. Um, now um, I'll get the red and white, these two, put red and white here, slice, and put it back here. Okay, so the last one is the blue and white slice and put it back so now I see that orange is pretty decent so yeah I'll, I'll just go with the orange uh, now red is also pretty good red here and last is blue and green which can be easily solved and now I see that uh, the two greens are right here and here so um, I'll, ro I'll slice this here put the green here so when I slice back it's solved and I'll put this in so I see that um, one edge is already solved so I'll just let that be since it's already in the top put this in these two rotate put this one in last one is this edge put this edge in okay now um i'll slice and then looking for this one which is here and now this one which is here now last one is yellow and red which is here okay so no parody because the first one was already solved so that's pretty convenient that was a nice easy solve so yeah for um during the holidays if you have any suggestions of any videos you want me to do or like cubing related not cubing related if you want to see brian again or um i could team up with uh Matt's Matt's channel, Matt's Games HD, um, maybe Damon's channel, uh, Cube Ninja, I believe, and if you want, whatever you want to see, just leave it down in the comments. So, again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.